guys, so today I'm going to talk about the products that I keep repurchasing. This is very difficult for me because actually I don't really stay loyal to products very often, so the ones that I do stay lo loyal to, it's kind of a big deal to me. And it's kind of difficult to think of them all, so maybe I'm missing some out in this video, but I've been making a list for the past couple of weeks of products that I absolutely love, so I'm going to run through them pretty quickly because I don't have time to talk in depth about them. So let me just start randomly, no particular order. The first is the Sally Hansen Polish Remover. This is the one for all types of nails because they have some like a blue one that's for acrylic nails, whatever. This one is the one that I use. It removes my nail polish really well, doesn't dry my nails out. I absolutely love this product and I always, always reach for this. I won't use any other nail polish remover because they either are too oily, they don't remove my nail polish all well, or they're drying, whatever. This one's great. Um, along the nail polish line, or conversation, is the Sally Hansen Insta Dry Anti Chip Top Coat, the one in the red bol bottle. This stuff is amazing. It gives such a nice shine to my um, nail polish, makes my nail polish last so much longer, and I love it because it does dry pretty quickly, but it's very thin as well. Love that product. Now, the next one is the La Roche Posay Hydrant Riche Cream. Um, they have one that's a lighter version, but this stuff is amazing. It has hyaluronic acid in it, which I think is what makes it so amazing for my skin. So hydrating. I use this day and night. Amazing under makeup as well. Love, love, love this product. If you have dry skin, definitely look into that product. The next one is Carmex. This is just a classic for me. Lip balm. It's the only lip balm that will work on my lips. I have gone through so many little... Um, balms of this, what would you say, a little tub? I don't know. So many. And also, I will say the balm is way better than the stick or the tube. This formula is the best. Next is tea tree oil. Again, I've gone through a bunch of little bottles of this. I'm not loyal to a particular brand, I'm just loyal to the oil itself. I use this on blemishes. Uh, I use it just on its own or I mix it with coconut oil if it's a little bit too strong. Absolutely love tea tree oil, just a classic, still it just never lets me down. Now the next one is the Sorov Moisturizing Cream. Gone through a couple tubs of this. Uh, you can only get it in America, I think. I haven't found it here, but I use this all over my body every single day, morning and night. To be honest, I don't do it at night very often, but definitely right after the shower. I have to moisturize my skin right after the shower or else my skin gets super, super dry. So I love that product for moisturizing my body. Next is the coconut oil. I use this to clean my teeth. I'll do um, a kind of swish this around my teeth for like 15 minutes every single day. I also like to use this in the shower, like right at the end of my shower, I'll put this all over my body and it's really moisturizing, helps lock in the moisture of the water. I love this, I use it on my eczema bits. It doesn't get rid of it, but it helps a whole lot. Freaking love coconut oil and it's great to cook with as well. I haven't really cooked with it very often, um, but it is a lot healthier. The only thing I will say is when you are looking for coconut oil, make sure it's cold pressed. This one it has a bunch of other good things. No GMOs, no additives. It's by Lucy B. It's great. Love co Ooh. coconut oil. I was using it as a little drum. Okay, next is a toothpaste. I'm fully out of this one, but it's the Colgate Max White one. This one came out only a couple months ago in England and I've already repurchased it like four times. I love this toothpaste. It actually does whiten my teeth really well. Amazing, amazing stuff. Next is the Wella Pure Purifying Shampoo. I get this, you could probably only get it like, I think you could get it on feelunique.com which ships internationally. I get it in my local um, like hairstyle makeup artist beauty beautician shop. It's kind of like Sally's where you can get like a discount but if you are in the beauty industry. So I do get a bit of a discount, uh, which helps. But this stuff is amazing. I have quite oily hair. Even if you don't have oily hair though and you just use a lot of products in your hair, I really recommend a good purifying shampoo. This really strips out all that gunk from your hair. So I'll use this like once every two weeks and it's incredible. Great purifying shampoo. It's the best one I've ever used. 
Now, next one is another classic, Liz Earl Cleanse and Polish Hot Cloth Cleanser. This stuff is amazing, removes my makeup so nicely. I do have to use the muslin cloth with it, and really good. I mean, it just never fails me. I'll use other cleansers, but nothing works like this one. So I love, love, love this product. Next one is one, I don't think I've ever spoken about this on my YouTube channel, but I really like it. It's the Blackhead Clearing Daily Scrub by Clean and Clear. Um, this stuff, I, I don't use it every single day, but you can. I find that as long as I don't scrub too hard and I use it quite gently, I don't find that it's too drying or anything nasty on my skin. What I do find is that if I don't use this for a couple of weeks, I find that my blackheads around my chin and my nose do get quite bad. So I will only use this around my chin and my nose and maybe my forehead because I do get some blackheads around here in my T-zone every now and then, but I won't use it on the rest of my face because that's just too drying. But it actually works, really like this stuff. I've gone through a couple chews of this, they last forever. So I actually really like that product. And another one is the Dove Original Deodorant. <laughs> Sorry, but I had to add it. I've been so loyal to this deodorant, I love it. It works so well for me. I don't have extremely smelly armpits or sweaty armpits, but this stuff smells so good. I like the original one because it just smells beautiful. I love the smell of Dove products and really works for me, so hey. And now my last favorite. I love the Johnson Cotton Buds. I don't know why, but I'm so snobby and picky about my cotton buds, or Q-tips as you say in America. And I like these ones. First of all, I like that it has the blue plastic bit, and they seem like a lot better quality. They're a lot more sturdy, and I use this to kind of clean up my eye makeup, obviously from years. And um, I'm really loyal to the Johnson ones. I love these. And those are my products that I keep repurchasing. If I can think of any more, I'll obviously add them in. But another product or another video that I want to kind of, it's an add on to this. It's products that I love because there's some products that I don't have to keep repurchasing, um, but they're still just products that I absolutely love. So thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you want to keep updated with my newest videos. If you have any requests for new videos, then please leave them down downstairs. <laughs> down in the comments below and thank you so so much for watching. Take care guys. Bye!